Next, we'll chat about indoor growing setups. You don't necessarily need a lot of space. You can do this in an urban apartment, you can do it in a house or out in the country. So we're gonna focus on the colonization phase first. The most important one is gonna be your moisture level as well as preventing other contaminants from getting in there. So how do you prevent that from happening? Sterilizing or pasteurizing the medium or substrate you're growing in. The other part is actually just having it inside of a clean container that keeps the contaminants out. Is I'll grow inside of bags and this bag just has the tiniest little filter on it there which allows a little bit of oxygen in, a little bit of CO2 out. Other awesome thing about the bag is it keeps the humidity in. So for the fact that this bag is sealed and has a tiny little filter, I basically don't have to do anything about the humidity. My other favorite way to grow inside is actually inside of five gallon buckets. Temperature that's important as well. And different myceliums like different temperatures for ideal growing. Most myceliums will start growing around 10 degrees Celsius. Another interesting thing is it doesn't need light during this phase. A great place that people often put them is on top of their fridge, with a blanket over top of it. 